we look back towards Clibbury now across the valley you can just see it there nestling in the countryside it's quite a misty damp day today it's lovely to be out catch your ladies Right, we're approaching the uh, entrance to the Morley Estate. Uh, it's recently been taken over by a new owner, and thankfully, he's investing a lot of money in the estate and uh, treating it how it deserves to be treated. Uh, unfortunately, the previous owner neglected it for quite some years, but now I'm very pleased to say it's in good hands, it's been looked after and its future is going to be secured for a very long time. I've got to respect the geezer's privacy when I'm in here, so I won't be filming anything that is uh, uh, private or what have you. I've just got to be very careful about what I do. Cheers, catch you in a bit. Here we go. Beautiful, long drive. Got a lot of builders working in here at the moment, which is why there's all this signage but uh, it's really beautiful and it's a pleasure to walk through here. The first signs of spring are starting to appear from the ground, the white flowers, the snowdrops. Pleasure to see. We're currently towards the end of January 2020 and uh, hopefully this heralds the end of winter. I really feel privileged to be able to walk through here. Uh, I'm actually on a bridal way at the moment. Um, the estate is in such fabulous condition. The shooter busy banging away at some pheasants. To be fair, I'm sure the majority of the pheasants are perfectly safe. <laughs> um, but it's all good, lovely day. Really glad I made the effort to come out. Uh, really nice feeling of freedom. On my back, I've got everything I need. I've got my sandwich, I've got a bit of a cake for pudding, stuff to make uh, coffee. I've got some food if I need it, water filter if I need to produce some more water. I'm crossing the river in a, about a mile or so anyway. And uh, it's nice to know that I've got everything I need on my back to, stay out as long as I want to. Um, I've obviously got to get back because of the dogs, but uh, it's very nice to be able to do this sort of thing. Uh, a rare weekend where I have nothing to do, which is to be treasured, believe you. Believe you me. Through the mist there, you can see Sadler's Barn Farm uh, and uh, Redthorn Farm to its right. Clibbery Mortimer is round to right just behind the trees. Um, absolutely beautiful. I haven't been up here for too long. Off the main driveway now, I'll come to the end of it. Uh, heading fast towards the uh, stone track that goes down to uh, the lower forge. I usually see this view from the other side of the valley at Friends Farm where we're doing some work at the moment. Uh, it's nice to be here. Some absolutely ancient trees, I mean, look at that. It's incredible. So, yeah, a privilege to be here in the South Shropshire countryside. There in the distance through the trees is uh, my good friend Bob's farm. Uh, we're working on the barn on the right hand side of the range as we look at it. And uh, it's absolutely beautiful. It's 
it's a little bit wet underfoot but I'm walking on a uh, on a stone road here so I'm not sinking very deep it's a good job because I've just got my uh, Salomon trainers on to walk today uh, beautiful deer fencing there oh and deer in the woods look wow wow I don't know if you can pick them up it's amazing Look at that. What a treat. That's absolutely incredible. Now that sports fans has made my day. So there's obviously some pretty heavy duty repair work going on here which is absolutely fantastic because it was in terrible state a few years ago and uh, yeah the shoot had just gone in for lunch very jealous of their little setup but yeah it's fantastic Beautiful. work underway to uh, restore the old mill race which is a fantastic thing peacocks look <laughs> and peahens. The quality of the workmanship here is absolutely outstanding. That's uh, a proper tradesman's work. Views back up towards Baton. And this is the rookery. Absolutely beautiful. Now we're approaching the rookery. It's not far until I get onto the uh, the back lane between Clibri and Baton, and that's where I'll close the video. Thank you very much for watching. It's been an absolutely beautiful day, and uh, if you enjoyed it, please click the like. Um, I hope to be doing a few more of these. So, if you'd like to subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you again. Cheers, then. Ta-da!